What's going on YouTube? Uh, I'm bringing another video. Again, it's very sunny out. A little tank update and how everything's doing. Still can't figure out what these guys are. Oh, he's a little pissed today. I think I know why. I got a stupid starfish hanging off of him. But, uh, oh, okay, let's get back here. Yes, yeah, just a little update here. Uh, everything's doing pretty good. Um, so you see, I just have this chilling down here. This had my angry or uh, my Incredible Hulks on it, and these little bastards destroyed it. I uh, came over to one night, and they were a couple on there chewing on it. But anyway, this isn't what I'm up to show you. What I'm showing you is the sump eye got going on. Got it all hard too. Just painted it black to make it a little prettier. I guess. Not really. And then I got the my old protein skimmer and I just got this new C clone. And for what I got going on in my sump. You guys are probably gonna laugh but I mean it's so far working for me. I stuck a piece of hose in there because those was just getting way too much splash and then I ended up just trimming the cap that was originally for this uh, tub to reduce the amount of water loss that I was getting. And basically it's just I got some PVC for the drainage uh, that can be pure and some potato. Um, it's just temporary right now until I can get a nicer sump. I had this stuff laying around and I was getting sick and tired of protein skimmers hanging on the back and whatnot and water level changing so the protein skimmer wasn't doing exactly what it should be doing. So I had this stuff just laying around. And then it just basically it just drains into here and then gets sucked up into the pump. I had this breeder net just laying around. I figured, oh, I might as well put it in there to help maybe collect some of the bubbles that get passed through. And then from the Aquatop pump, the 475, same as what I had before, I went and hard plumbed pretty much everything the ball valve and then up the side here and back in to what you see there. Sorry my girlfriend decided to decorate the tank for Halloween. But uh yeah I took the back off the uh, back picture off you can see all my crap there. Um but yeah that's really about it what I added. Um the only thing that I kept in the tank still was just the heater. Um, I didn't feel like taking it out. Um, I figured I'd just lift it in there. And um, put that back on there. But uh, yeah, yeah, that's about it. Um, Let's see what else maybe I could show you around here that I haven't gotten before. Here's my feather duster is finally out. I don't think he was out last video. I got it's cool. Got some more like kind of growing like all over the place. They got like red. Oh yeah, he's hiding now. Okay, go figure. Uh, I don't know. There's a couple more somewhere, but um, I still can't figure out what these guys are. Um, I mean, I can see they move all around. I mean, I got some down in the sand bed here. That's what's going on with my my Duncan. There's one that's trying to move on there, and not 
cool. I'm gonna have to try to figure out how to get him out. You know, there's some underneath it, alongside it. I mean, they just move all over the place. I mean, they're cool. But, uh, I can't figure out what the hell they are. Uh, some kind of polyp, but they move? I don't, I don't know. Maybe you guys can let me know. Pops are doing pretty good. Let me see where the other set. Uh, other bass are down here. So uh, my uh, brain coral or the uh, Velvia, or however you pronounce it, he's uh, starting to get some color back. He wasn't doing too good. He was starting to bleach out, but now he's starting to get it back. And uh, these guys, these guys are still multiplying. Um, as you can tell, I had them on two separate rocks that I had to cut apart because of moving stuff around. And my toadstool, he's doing pretty good. Look at him. He's freaking full all now. He's looking good. I'm dropping my phone here. Of course, my name is trying to get some attention here. But, alright, well, let me know, uh, let me know what you guys think. Alright, have a good one.